A reversal from the Warwick School Committee. Kindergarten students now have to wait at least another month. To begin in-person learning, students previously slated to move to the Vets Middle School for that to happen. 12 News reporter Alexander Leslie has the details from this morning's virtual school committee meeting. Warwick School Committee leaders say they were torn making the decision to get kindergartners back in school, but a large price tag and a short timeline ultimately guided this reversal. Earlier this month, Warwick School District announced a plan to use CARES Act money to purchase 600 air purifiers after school walkthroughs confirmed concerns about building ventilation. A previous timeline estimated the installations would take two to three months, but committee leaders now say the vendor said they could make it happen on or about October 23rd, and the cost for the units would be at least $100,000. I'm hoping the timeline is true and the company will stick to that timeline that they promised us. That was the concern of other school committee members, but the Hefty price tag for the shorter timeline with the possibility the shipment might get delayed also raised concern. It's a lot of money for at least as we sit here today to spend over a period of about four weeks. Committee members also brought up possible social emotional repercussions. It's the confusion for the kids to start at vets and then go back to their other room. It's it's a lot of adjustment for little kids. Ultimately, the committee decided to wait for the units to be shipped and installed. Motion to continue download learning not to move students to vets and to place the students in their own school classrooms as soon as they are ready. All in favor? Aye. 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 The ayes have it, 5-0. School leaders say the vendor told them last night that the units were still not in stock, but they were still on track for an October 23rd delivery. I'm Alexandra Leslie, 12 News.